Good morning. Buongiorno. What's the forecast today? Oh, today is February the 10th. It's going to be a high of 65, and it's going to be mostly sunny. My portfolio went up 8% this week. 8% in a single week. How do you do it? I do my research. Well, clearly, because not everyone is able to outperform the Dow Jones year in and year out. <laughs> you just gotta know where to look. Not everyone can be in the top 2% of daily fantasy sports earnings. Hey, I just came up with the idea. I gotta give credit to the engineers. They're the guys that wrote that dynamite algorithm. Well, let's face it. We're both pretty impressive. I'll drink to that. <laughs> underlying fundamentals support the market. There are way more buyers and ways to buy than ever before. Record sales aren't enough to keep up with that demand, and that demand isn't going away. Could be right. But don't you think this buying frenzy is unsustainable? Everyone rushing so they don't miss out? Everyone assuming prices will stick or keep rising? Wouldn't that inflate demand more than the fundamentals suggest? It's feeling awfully bubbly to me. <laughs> <laughs> Sandwiches are incredible. <laughs> oh, I know. Aren't they amazing? Hmm. Hey, Caitlin. Hey. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> you nearly took her head I'm off. I'm so sorry. Hi. Hey, how's it going? <laughs> I'm fantastic. How are you? Can't complain. I'm good. Glad to hear it. Well, I'm going to go do my rounds, but it was really good to see you all. Yeah, you too. <laughs> I told you I could kick it head level. <laughs> all right, all right. That's easy, though. Can you do the king pigeon? Ooh. So I just, okay, no, 
now, though? Yeah, was it just you out there? I mean, what were you even doing? It was just the three of us. Nobody close by for a hundred miles. Well, sounds like you've already got a bidding war going on. We'd see black bears as close as that young man over there. Wow. Oh, yeah, you know, black bears aren't anything to worry about, though, as long as their cubs aren't around. Do need to worry about them stealing your fish, though. <laughs> That's, it's just incredible. I mean, nothing like that ever happens here. Not that I mind, but it just doesn't. Yeah, you know, it really is the most beautiful place. How wonderful is this party? Well, hey, these are our it's friends, good. Jen and Peter. How do you do? This is Joe. Pleased to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you. Joe, he's the most interesting person you're going to talk to. He's from Alaska. Oh, wow. <laughs> I've always wanted to go. I can't imagine living there. <laughs> By the way, about this evening, is there any way that we could do 8.30? I totally spaced the timing of this little party. Oh, yeah, no, that's why I texted you and said it should be 8.30. But you guys can come over for drinks earlier if you want. This darn thing hides text messages from me. God, I'm <laughs> such a light. Good, good oh, job. there it is. Okay, <laughs> so exciting. Perfect way to spend an evening after a perfect afternoon. <laughs> come on, let's get some food, huh? Yes. <laughs> Hopefully they move on. You are so lucky Ken went to culinary school. Don't I know it. Peter, on the other hand, is really great at ordering takeouts. <laughs> hey, give me a grill and I'll tenderize the hell out of a porterhouse. I can actually dodge for that, so. Mm, but we are trying to eat less red meat. Aren't we all? Mmm, <laughs> that's refreshing. That is a vodka tonic. <laughs> What can I say? I love the simple things, but I love this too. Next drink, I'll make you one. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. Ah, oh, yeah, there we go. Oh. Peter, you really love those eye drops, man. I swear he's addicted. Oh. Every few hours, he's got to have his fix. <laughs> Gatorade for your eyeballs. <laughs> you keep your body hydrated, why not keep your eyes hydrated? Right. Hey, did you get the score from last round? Uh, 45 to 7. Mm -hmm. Yes, 45 to 7. I am happy to announce that we are taken to the enemy. Where are your enemy? Open. Uh, pass. Pass. 30. 31. 2. 3. 4. 5. 6. 7. 38. 39. 40. <laughs> Cards. Ugh, oh, how fun playing cards. It's how vintage. It's really getting my blood pumping. Oh, yeah, my family lives for this game. <laughs> so I decided to only work four days instead of five. 
It means that we're not gonna get to remodel the kitchen as soon as we like, yeah. but honestly, I think I'll just be happier. Yeah, and <laughs> absolutely. And, all right, I know this is gonna sound so simple, but I just really think that one of the most important things in life is doing what makes you happy, right? It's one of those things that seems so obvious, but can sometimes be really hard to actually yeah. do. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> no. okay. Well, actually, I did double file, which I was hesitant to do, but James, oh, you know James, right? Mm -hmm. I love that guy. He brought up a great point. We're getting into a new space, and there's a ton of legal gray area. The Court of Chancery. How funny that's actually useful to you. <laughs> it's such a buzzword, it's kind of a joke, but it's not unreasonable to think we'll end up in a courtroom a couple years down the line. Oh, speaking of court, did I finish telling you about that German-Canadian investment firm oh, we're Oh, yeah, you were getting to the juicy part. Tell me, tell me. <laughs> so, real estate investment firm. All the usual skeletons there. Some bribes to an indicted city councilman. No smoking gun. The wildest part. Is the family drama. So I told you it's arbitrary one. tasks for some reason. And I don't know why. So for example, you know, I'm driving to get pick up coffee filters. I go to one store, they don't have brother. So I drive to the second store and they don't have it. As I'm driving to the to third store, his own I'm like, nephew, his we have least favorite. We just don't have a full thing of coffee filters. Allegedly. So I can just order them on Amazon and be good to go there. You know? What happens when they come over to America? They just turn into savages. But then you got to keep a view of the bigger picture. Satanizing. What was your favorite part of today? I'm actually going to go with the cards. Look, there was, it was really fun, and the comeback we mounted was incredible, and Jen and Peter loved it. I told you, and you were skeptical. I told you it wasn't just for old folks. Yeah, I know, I know. What about you? Cards were definitely a high point. Mm -hmm. But I feel like talking to Joe was just so fascinating. Do you know how many times he's almost died? He has the most incredible stories. It's not every day you meet a real-life Alaskan search and rescue pilot. Yeah. yeah. How would you rank today overall? Oh, just another one of the best days of my life. You? <laughs> yeah, I'd say the same. <laughs> I love you. Oh, I love you too. Good morning. The Broho Ranku. Is that Ukrainian? Where did you learn that? I got that one from Eastern European boxing. Oh, of course, Eastern European boxing, right? Yeah. You know Ukrainian? Well, yeah. Wait, did I never tell you that our au pair when we lived in Milan was Ukrainian? I thought your au pair was Filipino. Yeah, yeah. Well, that was when we were in Valencia, though. Oh, of course. That makes sense. Yeah. What's the forecast today? Today is February the 11th. It's a high of 58. It's just a little bit cloudier. So still great. I'm going to the store today, as promised yesterday. And as promised, I made you a list. Mm -hmm. What's for dinner tonight? Tonight we're having penny ala vodka with a side of apple kale salad. Mm -hmm. Perfect. 